just signed up for T-Mobile 5G home internet or considering making the switch? You might be wondering how to set up T-Mobile home internet and what exactly do you get? In this video, we'll walk you through the entire setup process so you can get connected in just a few minutes. No technician required. What's in the box? Here's what you'll typically find inside. T-Mobile 5G gateway, power adapter, optional window mount bracket for better signal placement. Step one, plug it in. Connect the power cable to the back of the gateway. Plug the other end into a standard wall outlet. Wait for the T-Mobile logo to appear. That means the gateway is powering up. Step two, download the T-Life app. Search T-Life in the App Store or Google Play. The app will guide you through setup and let you manage your connection afterward. Step three, log in or create your T-Mobile ID. Open the app and log in using your T-Mobile ID or create one. Tap Let's Go to begin setup. Step four, find the best placement. Placement is key since the gateway connects wirelessly to T-Mobile's 5G network. Use the placement assistant in the T-Life app to find the strongest signal. Step five, customize your Wi-Fi. Now the app will ask you to change your Wi-Fi name and password. Choose a custom Wi-Fi name and password. Tap submit to save your settings. Connect your devices to the new network. You're online. You're now connected to T-Mobile's 5G home internet. Use the T-Life app to monitor your signal and connected devices. Change settings, troubleshoot if needed. To check more details, check out our full post, link in the description. Conclusion. T-Mobile 5G home internet offers a modern wireless alternative to traditional broadband. It's easy to install, easy to manage, and gets you online fast without the hassle of cables or technician visits, already using it or planning to try it. Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more tech guides and setup walkthroughs. Thanks for watching Techzoid. We'll see you in the next one.